this video will take you through how to look for the staff attendance and to produce a staff attendance register in your particular group of stores or restaurants. So if I go to Analytics BI again, you'll see that there are two attendance registers. One is a historical one and then the other is um, an attendance for today. So let's start with the historical attendance. This will give us a view of all staff attendance over the last week. So this week has just kicked off, so I don't have anything at the moment. But if I go last week or last seven days, this month, last month, that'll give me all the staff attendance, when they arrived, um, the date, the actual store that they arrived at, um, all the information that they recorded, um, and that all the checks have been done. So not only is it just when do people actually arrive and start their shifts and are recorded, but it's also the actual attendance register and any issues that might have come up against that. So if I look at last month, um, hoping that there's one or two issues here. So if we go through, looks like there aren't any, otherwise um, they would have appeared as red and you would have seen them not only in the alerts, but in this, in this grid as well. What you also see is that um, it shows all the number of attendances over the period of time, so in the last month, um, how many people attended in each of the different stores. So it might be that some of the registers are being are not being filled out and that immediately gives you an insight that the actual staff attendance is not being done um, in the system itself. Um, and, and that is obviously significant um, because it's not going to raise any issues. You can filter on a particular um, store or restaurant um, so you can go in and it'll then give you an idea of how um, it's tracked over that period of time. The gaps would indicate that there's certain thing, uh, bits of information that haven't been done at that point in time maybe um, so it's something to, to address. Um, and you can see very quickly when and who is doing what and when people are, are attending. The attendance today is just very similar except that it is a attendance for today or yesterday. Um, it gives you a view immediately as and when the attendance is happening on the day itself um, as opposed to a historical view. So for today I can see all the attendance, um, when people came in, what time they came in for the first shift um, and any subsequent shifts from there. So I hope you enjoyed that and I look forward to seeing you on the next one.